Stop authorizing the devil. Tuwing may nangyayaring hindi maganda sa iyong buhay, madalas mo bang nasasabi na inaatake ka ng kaaway o ng demonyo? Situations like a project that won't take off, fake news, o chismis against you. Or people misjudge you and as a result, you start feeling depressed. Ang dami mong palpak sa buhay, lahat bang ito'y sinisisi mo kay satanas? While it is true that all evil things originate from the devil, God's Word says that He has given us the authority and the power to stop Satan's schemes against us. After returning from their mission, the 72 followers of Jesus reported, Lord, even the demons submit to us in your name, he replied. I have given you authority to trample on snakes and scorpions and to overcome all the power of the enemy. Nothing will harm you. What a great authority! Kung lahat ng kapangyarihan ay ibinigay na sa atin, ang ibig sabihin nito ay walang kapangyarihan ang kaaway o ang demonyo unless bigyan natin ito ng authority to rule over our lives. The devil can only succeed against us if we allow him to. Kaya nagbilin si Apostle Paul na huwag nating bigyan ng pagkakataon ng Diablo. Stop him right away from feeding lies in your mind. Huwag mong hayaan na maghari sa puso mo ang galit, inggit, self-pity, bitterness, hopelessness, at negative things na hindi galing sa Holy Spirit. Instead, fill your mind and spirit with God's powerful Word. Sa pangalan pa lamang ni Jesus ay makakamit mo na ang tagumpay laban sa kaaway dahil nananahan siya sa iyo. Binigyan ka na ng tagumpay ng Panginoong Heso Kristo. Let us pray. Lord Jesus, thank you for giving me all authority in heaven and on earth to defeat the enemy and to overcome all his evil schemes against me. Thank you for reminding me today to stand on that authority so I can live a victorious life. In Jesus' name, Amen. Right now, ask the Holy Spirit to reveal areas in your life where the devil has a hold over you. Times when you subconsciously allowed him to make you feel depressed, oppressed, or defeated. List them down. Now say aloud, Satan and your cohorts, I cancel the authority that I have given you over my life. In Jesus' name, Amen. Yan ang gawin natin. Then declare, I claim God's promise of blessings and victory over my life. Thank you, dear Holy Spirit, for the fruit of love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. Huwag ninyong bigyan ng pagkakataon ang Diablo. Ephesians chapter 4, verse 27. Ako po si Eric Totanyas, pinagpala ka ng Diyos. Bye-bye.